like, comment, and subscribe to Mythic Machines. Welcome back, and I'm Cody. Today, then a sandblast in the floor pan and wire reeling what I had to do to clean it off, to expose all of the spot welds here, and see them all up and down and across. Today we're going to be drilling out all the spot welds. And I'll show you how to do a couple, then do the rest of off camera, because it takes a while. First off, what I'm using to cut out the spot weld is the Blair spot weld cutter kit. It's quite useful. It comes with three cutting tips and an extra pilot. And all that just mounts on to your end of the cordless drill there. And to use it, you just put it on the drill. Now, I'll also be using an automatic center punch. So there's no hammer and punch involved, which is nice. But to drill out the spot welds, all you do is put your center punch in the middle as you possibly can and you make a nice little starting pilot. Once you've done that you have the little pilot drill bit that sits in the very tip of the butt and then you have your cutting edge around there. Get your bit, ready to get started. Once you get your drill bit on there, you can just get it centered on there. Now it spin, make a nice little hole. And then you slowly Put it down until it starts making contact. And you just push down on it, and it cuts it out. you see that it's gone all the way to the top layer because that's all you want to cut. You don't want to cut the bottom layer of it because that part's not replaceable. And you simply do that over and over again until you have them all cut out. So, show you on the next one. Put it in the center as close as possible you can get. You're starting, get your drill bit. That's it. That's all you got to do to cut out spot welds. It's quick, it's simple, it's not that difficult. 
long as you have the right tools to do it. Anyways, I'll come back once I got them all drilled out. Along with this back, the front of the floor pan, and all of my, and both the seat risers. You see you then. All right, as you can see, I got most of my spot welds cut out. There in the back. On the side and everything and down there. And a few more to do here. And you got all the spot welds cut out on the bottom of this plate of the seat riser. Other than where it's been rusted out and spot welds no longer exist. And on the front, those three, because none of it exists. And then I just got the four to do up there. And the TIG welds. And the spot welds here. And then just got the little welds right here on the top. But I'll cut those off when I, and just cut them off with the welds there with the plasma cutter. Now I got the same to do with my other side. And that'll be it. No, other than the, the few that are up here on the tunnel. Now I got left to cut out. But this is taking a lot of time. And I'm not out of time for the day. So I'll be finishing up throughout the week. So, if you enjoyed, like, subscribe, and share with a friend. Who knows? Maybe they'll enjoy it too. Thank you for watching, and I'll be next episode. Or the next part, I'll be showing. I'll be rubbing the old floor plan out and putting the new one in. So, until then, have fun.